Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says Find the least number of years for which an annuity of $1200 per annum interest run in order that its amount just exceeds $25000 at 8% compounded annually. Now in case of Immediate annuity, we have A is equal to small a upon i into 1 plus i to the power of n minus 1 the whole, where this capital A is the amount of annuity Small a is the annual payment of each installment then n is the number of periods of the annuity R percent is the rate of interest per period and this I is equal to R upon 100. This is the key idea that we use in this question. In the question, we are asked to find the least number of years, that is we have to find n and we are given that the annuity is of $1200 per annum. The amount is also given to us and also the rate of interest is also given to us. Let's proceed with the solution now. First of all, we suppose that the annuity runs for n years and so we are supposed to find n as the payment would be made at the end of each period so this is the case of immediate annuity and so we will use this formula, in the question we have the amount of annuity as $25,000. So we have the amount of annuity given by capital A is equal to $25,000. And small a, which is the annual payment of each installment, is given as $1,200. So small a is equal to $1,200. Then the rate of interest per period, that is R percent, is given as 8 percent per annum. And so I is equal to R upon 100 that is 8 upon 100 equal to 0 0.08. Let us now consider the formula capital A equal to small a upon I into 1 plus I to the power of N minus 1 the whole where we have to find out the N. So putting the respective values we have 25,000 is equal to 1200 upon 0 0.08 into 1 plus 0 0.08 that is i this whole to the power of n minus 1 the whole. Now removing this decimal we put here two zeros. So we now have 25000 into 8 upon 1 2 0 0 0 0 is equal to 1.08 to the power of n minus 1. 
Now these three zero cancel with these three zeros and eight. Fifteen times is one twenty. Now five. Three times is fifteen and five. Five times is twenty five. So we have five upon three is equal to one point zero eight to the power of n minus one. And from here we have one point zero eight to the power of n is equal to five upon three plus one, which is equal to eight upon three. And this is equal to two point six six six. So we now have one point zero eight to the power of n is equal to two point six six six. Now Taking log on both the sides, we get n into log of 1.08 is equal to log of 2.666, and thus from here we have n is equal to log of 2.666 upon log of 1.08. Now, log of 2.666 is 0.4259 upon log of 1.08 is 0.0334. Now decimal cancel with each other, and so we have n is equal to 4259 upon 334, and thus we have n is equal to 12.75. Hence, the least number of years is equal to thirteen years. That is, twelve point seven five is rounded off to thirteen, and so this is our final answer. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.